Dr. Jordan Mallon. I'm with the Canadian Museum of Nature. I'm a paleontologist there. And I have with me two fossils today that are, are being returned to the Tyrrell Museum. Uh, the first fossil that I've got is uh, a tooth of a big carnivore, an animal that we call Albertosaurus, uh, a close relative of Tyrannosaurus rex, um, probably maybe 30 to 40 feet long, and you know, 75, 73 million years ago, it would have feasted on an animal something like this, or that had a bone something like this. This is a, a, a jawbone, a maxilla, upper jaw of an animal called a hadrosaur, a duck-billed dinosaur. And uh, unlike the carnivore, which had a big sharp tooth, these hadrosaurs, if I turn, well, this might be the best way to see it. These hadrosaurs had what are called tooth batteries, where you have multiple generations of teeth all growing out at once. And as they grew, they created one big continuous grinding surface, almost something like, a, like an elephant's tooth that you might see today. And they used these, uh, these teeth, these two batteries, to grind up their, their food. They were able to eat very tough plants that way. There you go. 